Okay guys, hello. I'm doing an updated video to washing my dentures. Nothing really has changed, but I'm going to update it. Some of the products may have changed. Um, I'm using this Natural Dentist Denture Cleaning Toothpaste. It's for dentures only, not for your mouth. And it's in the flavor peppermint, no sodium, laurel sulfate. Okay. Removes denture stains caused by coffee, tea, wine, and tobacco. Gentle abrasive and freshness, freshens mouth. I got it at the Amelia's Grocery Outlet for like $1.50. And then to clean my mouth, I'm just using Crest Baking Soda and Peroxide Whitening. So let's get started. And I will be putting this stain away into my denture bath. So hopefully my phone does not fall into the sink because I'm trying to attempt this without I'm going to be buying a camera this week. I know I said that years ago, but I think I'm going to be getting back into Dale. I'm going to be vlogging at least two times a week, maybe. So no, you won't hear from me a year later because I am getting into this. But you might, you'll hear from me, but I'm going to get the camera probably in February. I was on YouTube looking for a good camera, so again I put that on my denture brush and here is my plate here at the bottom okay I don't know if you can see what's going on here but let me see I'm gonna keep looking in the end okay so you clean it Sometimes it's hard to get inside this little divot right here, but I use this little thing. I wish it was a little longer. No, it's not. So we'll clean. Actually, I already cleaned this one, so I'm not going to do a long cleaning on this. And I was like, oh crap, I can make a video. But I know there's a lot of for videos out there. A lot of people getting dentures now. It has definitely changed from four years ago, which I'm, gl I'm glad. I'm, it's great to see people out there. Now, I need to learn how to get my videos monetized and set that up. Because I have over a thousand subscribers. And my one video that I did, well, the two videos that I did. See, I like to get in the teeth area with this little thing. It does help get the food out and a lot of plaque filled up. Yeah, and the gums. Make sure you do this little divot. Of a little divot. Flip that bad boy around and clean the back teeth. This, now again, this is just my way of doing it. Now I'm rinsing the teeth off. I know you probably can't see because the camera is too close. So I am rinsing it off. And then I'm gonna set that into my box. I'll just set it there so we have a spot for it. And then I'll show you when I fill up the water. Now I'm taking my bottom plate, which some people didn't see in the other video. Here's my bottom plate. I do the same thing, but you don't need a lot of paste for this one. Put that there. I'm just going to clean in there. So we're already at four minutes for this video. The last ones I made were very, very long. Um, but yeah, like, I think at this point in my life, if I had the money, I'd be ready to move on to the all in four procedure or implant secure dentures, so rude dentures, however you say it. Yeah. I have lost a lot of weight, so my gums have shrank, which makes my dentures a little bit big. 
but I just have my husband realign it for me and maybe I'll do a video on that where he comes in and shows you how to do the Walmart realign kit. Not the brand new Walmart, but it's I got it from Walmart and it's called Realign It, I think. That's what I've been doing because my dentist does not do a chair side realign. It has to be sent out to the lab, which I work. I can't be without my dentures for two to three days or whatever. And then I went to another dentist and they said that it would be 10 days. Like, I thought some dentists do them chair side realign. Now that, there you have it for that one. I'm just rinsing it all. You rinse it all off. Okay. And you rinse your brush off. Because that all off. Okay. Yeah. So now, we are going, and again, you know what? I really screwed up with this. From the beginning, I should have covered my sink with a towel or a wash rag or washcloth because of the fact that you can have it drop into the sink and have a breakage. Some people lose the teeth, sometimes it cracks. So this is how I do it. Let's rinse that out. I do it with warm water, not scolding hot water because I heard it messes up your dentures. I'm going to put the bottom in there first. Okay, there you have it. Then I'm going to put the top on top. Now my water is pretty. Let's make it a little warmer. Okay. okay, that's good. Warm, lukewarm. You're going to fill it. And then we are going to put in the stain away which you can use three to five times a week, I think it says. And it's, this is really good. Now I'll do the Polydent and then I'll do this maybe once or twice a week. I got it at Walmart. And see, there's not that much room in this bathroom. I'm going to make sure your hands are dry when you fill, when you do this because it sticks to the cap. If like, it gets wet, it just, I can't explain it, it gets all sticky. So we're going to fill the cap, because that's what it says to do. See how it clumps up? Because, yeah. So I filled the cap with the product. That's all you need is one cap full. Maybe I should have put this in before I put the seats in, but this is what works for me. And I'm going to fill it. And I believe it says... I'm going to close the little center bath. And then we'll let it sit. Now this says you're going to let it soak for only 10 to 20 minutes. Okay. Got this from Walmart as well. Um, but there you have it. So we're going to let it soak for 10 to 20 minutes. Now I'm going to brush my gums which I will not show on camera, but you guys know how to brush your teeth or your gums or whatever you got going on. Some people have partials. And I'm gonna, I just use a soft toothbrush, soft head, because I don't like the medium or the hard. Oop, there, my toothpaste just fell in the sink. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. going gently. Alright, now I did that and I um, get my tongue real good in the sides of my mouth and the roof of my mouth. Get 
can taste the garlic that I had from my smelly oh. Mm. Now I'm gonna leave the sink running because that's what's holding up my thing right here. And I'm gonna go get my glue, I'll be right back. Now I have to use this old, the stuff that I have. I don't really prefer this. Anybody that watches my other videos know that I prefer free of flavor. It's, it's fixed for them, but it's free of flavors and free of colors. So I'm going to use the rest of this up because I don't have the other one. Um, I'm going to stop the video right here and make a part two of putting this on my dentures because that right now is soaking and I don't know how to edit. But uh, thanks for, uh, you know, checking me out here. <laughs>